All right, in preparation for uh, the upcoming season, everybody, I think everybody, gets kind of excited. And they start purchasing baits and lures and, and, and things that they believe are gonna help them out throughout the season. Um, especially coming up, maybe you're, you're anticipating spring, you're thinking about uh, maybe bed fishing or top water or even pre-spawn. Um, lures so I do the same thing and sometimes when you get an order you look at the order and you might question your sanity of why you chose what you did and you have to think back what was I drinking or what I don't know why I made those decisions, but I did. So anyway, uh, this is one of those instances where I am kind of questioning what I bought and why I bought it, but let's get into it. So this is a tackle warehouse order. I decided to make a top water order. So I picked, I went on and looked at, I like the new baits that Tackle Warehouse comes out with. I always like to try new baits. So I go in the new section, go in the top water section and I see some new top water stuff. So <laughs> yeah, that's great. All right, so let's just break it open and see what we ended up with. All right, first up, what, how do you say it? Castake, Castic, Castake, um, it's, uh, the Boyd Duckett series, the BD series, uh, he, there's, there's a whole series of baits that Boyd Duckett has put out. So this is really neat. It's a, I, I like throwing poppers, and this is a popper. But what's cool about this popper is, it is a soft plastic hollow body so it is a half ounce trying to see if that's gonna the eye seems pretty stable so it's gonna stay straight I don't know how how it's really rigged inside but there looks like there's a weight on the front you can see that and yeah, it's kind of neat. It's hollow. It's a hollow body, and it's soft. So yeah, I I don't know if there's other ones like it out there, but this will be the first one I've ever thrown, and it's kind of looks kind of good. I mean, I don't know how it's gonna pop. It's more rigid around the around the uh, mouth area, so it's it's gonna hold its shape. But we'll see how it pops or spits. I don't know if this is designed as a spitter or a popper. But yeah, that's, I kind of like it. So we'll go ahead and try that out. So boy, duck it. Good job, boy, duck it. So next up, again, popper style, the Jackal. SK Pop Grande HL Aurora Black. It's a 5 16 ounce, 2.6 inch. Oh yeah. This one rattles. Those hooks are so sticky. Okay, so. The Jackal, it's got a deep uh, popper in there, SK Pop Grande, yeah, looks like a good bait, popper style. Next up is the Lunker Hunt, Lunker Hunt, um, it's called the Link thought this was a really cool walking bait. I'm assuming it's a walking bait. Top water walking bait, yep. So this is the Link. 
really neat. I like how this looks. Four and a half inch, quarter ounce bait. Yeah, so we got one hook on the front. It's got really good paint job. But one hook, the eyes in the front looks really minnowy or I mean it all it looks snakish. It really does look snakish. Um, two hooks on the back. So I went ahead and got this is the black mamba. The other color which really makes sense that it looks like a snake is the garden snake and I think it's isn't the the garter snake but this is a garden snake I don't know if you can see that pattern in that or not so that should be a fun bait to throw and see if uh, any big old boils on it all right let's get into a questionable a questionable top water bait this is called the persuader black bird popper bass bait hand carved hand Painted featuring Mustad Ultra Point hooks. Look at that dude. He's a big one. This bait weighs 0 .08 ounces. Holy cow. Is that a bait or what? That is crazy. So it's hand carved. That looks like it looks like a it looks like a bird. And it let's see if them things are no. that's crazy. Got a crack in the paint in the back. I don't know if you can see that. But other than that, it looks good. It's nice and shiny, and the hooks are, you know, they're sticky. So, yeah, the Persuader Blackbird Popper Bass Bait. I think it might just do the trick. And, I mean, you're going to throw this uh, if you have a lot of cattails or or trees in an area that they're overhanging um, those bass are going to be used to birds being all around there and they're going to be waiting for those baby birds so it's a big bait don't get me wrong that that is a big bait but it is what it is so this is the last bait in the box it is a very expensive bait and I have no like I don't know I've never had a bait from these this company and comes in a box like such if you know what it is it is the ABT baby buzz bird baby duck color So we get a card, uh, ABT, Lure Company, Alan Borden, President, no thank you.
the ABT Baby Buzz Bird in Baby Duck. I, this is a $50 lure. Which brings me back to the um, the questionable why I made this purchase. And I'm wondering as I opened it up um, why I did. You can see that it's, it's not perfect. Um, The eye seems to be a, not exactly centered. Um, seems to be not exactly centered with the front. The spinners, they spin, but I'm not sure at the angle um, how they'll spin in the water. Somebody said it's a urethane resin. I don't remember who. You can see inconsistencies in the bottom, a lot of bubble areas. This is my first resin bait, so I'm not sure how that works. They have a weed guard back here. It's very uh, light, so it's not going to, you know, it'll guard a little bit, but not, not a whole lot. The hook looks to be at an, a downward angle a bit. Um, So, if you can land it on this side, I think it will it will be good in grass and stuff like that. Um, but man, if you if you flip it upside down, you're getting stuck. But I'm afraid if I hit one stinking rock, it is gonna bust this thing up, and I'm not sure. So, along with the other baby birds so I don't know the only way to really tell is to get this thing on the water and catch a giant with it um, I like the th the fact that it has two buzzers it's gonna be it's going when the baby ducks start being born this thing is going to be very very realistic and I can guarantee you're gonna catch some fish on this I just don't know really how it's gonna swim and how long it's gonna last and that's that's my worry but you know for fifty dollars who can go wrong so I don't know guys I don't know but I'm definitely going to do a video with this bait so you will see this bait soon coming out uh, the weather's getting warmer we're gonna get a cold snap this weekend but the weather's getting warmer and you are going to see uh, you're gonna see some stuff with this so I'm gonna toss it around and hope for the best so there you have it the top water order the new Top water products from Tackle Warehouse. And uh, stay tuned for this one. This is going to be a good video. Hopefully catch some, catch some pigs. But I really want to see how this swims. So don't be afraid to push the like button. Comment. Tell me if you fished with this. Please tell me. If you haven't, tell me what you think about it. Let me know. Uh, I want some honest opinions if you've seen it or if you've if you've used it if you've used any of these baits please comment in the section below and I'll see you out there